what I should say. So if you if you miss, uh, just don't finish the the combo. So you want to go slow. So I'm just gonna use my most powerful my most powerful death blow. You know because that does about 16 damage. The other one does a hell of a lot more if I remember right. So you know, just just go slow. You don't want him to use that. And if you do it right, you should be able to handle him. He's not too tough as long as you keep this in mind. That's the trick to him. Seems like all these bosses have some kind of trick. So just... Oh, see, look. I missed there, so I'm not going to finish the combo. I'm going to do some other combo. Oh, missed again. Okay. Um... We'll go with that. Jeez. Oh, he did it anyways. Yeah, look at that. 93 damage. Ugh. And he follows it up with a regular attack. Okay, so I can't handle another what a wimp. So I'm gonna go for the inner healing. Just trying to keep my HP up right now. That's good. Hopefully I don't miss this time so I can do a full death blow. Yep, there we go. Oh, I missed the death blow. And he counters with what a wimp. See, I mean, that's it. that's his strategy. He waits for you to miss and then he pulls that shit out. I didn't think I could miss on a death blow, but apparently you can. So, let's go for the inner healing once again. Ugh, I mean, that's... That's the gimmick of this fight, and it's not a fun one. He blocked it. That does not count as a miss. Oh, but I missed the death blow again. I, it's worth a shot, simply because, really, it's the only way you can do some real damage to him, if we're being honest. You know, look how much, how little damage I'm actually doing. So, yeah, it took a while, but I did start to miss it. You know, the percentages added up over time. Just, just keep your HP up, and it should work out just fine. Hopefully. Come on. Yes, hit him this time. You know, with the damage I'm doing, it shouldn't take any more. It all looks like that's it, because everything went away, and down I go. Yeah, it looked like that was raging. He used the same technique as me. How come? Oh, if you say I'm you from the future, I'm going to be pissed. There's no Terminator logic in this game, is there? Come on. Fighting brute strength with brute strength is a sign of a great fool, but my strength was stronger. It's obvious that a lighter body such as yours will always be at a disadvantage in a head-on attack. I just gave you a good example. That minor difference between you and I had this outcome. Now someone else with a mass several times as you like Rico, the outcome becomes highly apparent. This applies to gears as well. Even if you were, right, even if you were to get parts comparable to Rico's, there is still that difference in mass. To make up for this, one must commit to a single final strike that thrusts at the opponent's fissure. Hit their weak spot with everything you got at once. I've given you the hint. It's up to you to figure it out through experience. Why is it that you have the same fighting style as I? I know, I learned that all by myself. It took me years. How do you know my name? Tell me. Fine. It was three years ago. The one who took you in your mutilated state to that mountain village was none other than myself. You're the one who brought me to Lehan? Yes, at your father's request. My, my, my father? What's relation to my father? Khan and I were fellow students. It is Khan! Damn it! No! Khan? Is that my father's name? Why do you ask for your father's name? You haven't lost your... Yeah. So tell me anything you can, will you? In your injured state. I wouldn't have been surprised. Wise man. Khan Wong. That is your father's name. Since our youth, Khan and I studied the martial arts together. Father and you? 
Eventually, your father became an officer of a certain country. There he met a young woman. She was about 20 years old. Her name was Karen. She was like a flower in full bloom. Oh. Oh, don't think about your mother that way, dude. He means that she was extraordinarily beautiful. I, I, I see. Then he, she's... Yes, your mother. Karn married your mother. And I left on a journey to strengthen myself. Where is mommy? I see. According to Khan, when you were but a child, she passed away. Oh. Time passed. During my journey, I received a letter from Khan. The letter said that his son was taken away by a man. Khan once said you had special powers. The man who wanted that power took you. That man was Groff. Groff stole me as a kid? You've met him? Yeah, three times. It's amazing you are still in one piece. That I was still not powerful enough to achieve his ultimate goal. Let me hear more about this story. Khan wished to go find his son, and if possible, he wanted my help. I agreed to Khan's request and began searching for you and that man. Then came that one fateful night three years ago. It was a violent storm. The storm felt as if it would th was thrown at us through sheer rage that night. Khan notified me that he had located his son. So I headed for that location as if I was drawn to it. You and Khan were wounded badly. I have no idea what, you had, what had happened between you two and Groff. By then, Groff had already gone. I don't know why, but probably he was driven away by Khan. Khan decided to pursue Groff and left me to care for his son. Provide you with the necessary first aid and left you in the custody of those village people. Then I followed after Khan. You probably lost your memory when you were injured then. Why did my father pursue Groff? Because he stole you as a kid. What the hell is wrong with you, Faye? It was not only for the sake of the son, but also for the sake of the world that that man be disposed of. He had that if something were to happen to him, I would have to take care of the rest. I haven't seen or heard from him since. Groff said that my father was dead. Then that is a possibility. That is truly unfortunate. Do you remember anything about your fighting techniques? No. I just know them. Yeah, Khan probably fought, taught him to him. Yeah, probably. Probably started under the same master. That's why my techniques are similar to yours. Okay, so Faye's not the only one that knows these techniques. That's very important information. I must be off. To where? I will go find him. I need to pinpoint what his intentions are. And also, for Khan's sake! Khan! What country was my father an officer for? Are you going there? I don't know. There are other things I have to take care of. Yes. The floating lion which tries to hide behind a wall, protected, as if to conceal their failure. That is Shavat. That is your father's country. Shavat? The floating land? Farewell. And then he fades into the night. Hey. 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 What the fuck just happened? Is this the second time you have met him? You were supposed to be in the crowd, Satan. What the hell? For the... You were watching my tournament, dude? What the hell's wrong with you? He sure is a mysterious person. That, yeah, that says the least. Oh, I've only known you since you arrived here. What is this Ave tournament? What is going on? Yeah, you'll you'll probably never understand, Faye. You're a little you're a little slow, but that's okay. I might be able to do something tomorrow, so I don't know. Wait, wasn't it Carr that said that he was our father? Now it's Khan. These are way too close. I mean, I don't know if I'm going to be able to keep this straight. Never underestimate the situation. You might lose pretty badly if you think you can just win by getting a grasp of the concept. I know, Doc. Well, let us return to our quarters and rest, Fair. Your fate lies in the outcome of tomorrow's competition. You need to preserve your strength. 
So we've got two people claiming to be our father, apparently. We've got a con, and we've got a car. Um, I don't know, can you assume that those are close enough that they're the same person? I don't know if you can. Alright, so I am going to save once again. Be right back. Alright, it looks like that's going to do it for these episodes of Let's Play Xenogears. I know it's kind of a short little session here, but we will take on the battling champ next time. I hope you guys have enjoyed these parts. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.